In tonight's battle, Mark the Baron takes on Kyle the Terminator in a three-round contest at the Docks nightclub. Each round is a challenge carefully designed to test a player's ability to seduce women in a real-life battlefield. The cameras are hidden, the women are real, and the game is on. Across town at Kai Lounge, our expert panel of pickup commentators with perspectives descending from the four corners of the male psyche. There's Alan, the cold, calculated master of pickup analysis, Peaches, an ex all star jock inspired seduction specialist, Sheldon, the mysteriously coy and unorthodox philosopher, and Chris, a hopelessly romantic man of integrity. Together, they will closely critique each player's performance and crown a single champion. The prize, a limo escort to an epic VIP event where the champion and his closest friends will enjoy full bottle service and the company of our sexy VIP girls. Tonight, the party's in the Polynesian pimp suite at Grass Nightclub. Let's take a closer look at tonight's players. Up first, Mark the Baron. How's it going? My name is Mark. This is my pad. I really like the dark mahogany furniture. I believe it represents power, and I believe it represents class. This is my bookshelf here. I've got a assortment of books. In order to communicate with girls, you have to be able to intellectually communicate with them. I have an assortment of colognes that I like to use. This is more of a summer cologne. It's a Caribbean tonic or Bermuda tonic, as they say. Last but not least, I've got my uh, lotion. I am the ultimate player because I have no inhibitions, and I know that I have nothing to lose except maybe my pride and my sense of self-worth if I get denied, but that doesn't matter because I'm out there to have a good time. If you get quality girls, then you're a ladies' man. If you get quantity, you're a man whore, and that's it. That's the bottom line, and you don't want, you don't want to be, aspire to be a man whore because all that happens to them is they get rashes. I don't know if you noticed the one thing there. He says, you don't want to be aspire to be a man whore. He didn't even pause, he just drank his drink. He looked up nervous and he was like, as if... Because I am. Because oh, I, I am a man whore. <laughs> At least tell it to me. I, I, I think there's a couple women out there that can testify to the latter that he is a man whore. I like the fact that he's studying. He's, he's reading up, he's got something to say. The only thing I'm surprised you guys didn't slag on him a little bit is that he's got like a couple push-ups that he desperately needs to do. Yeah. <laughs> or the, the little soliloquy he had in the mirror trying to convince himself that he's a player. That, that, was, that was quite touching. He obviously pays attention to the finer details. You know, the clones, the, the cream and uh, being articulate. So far, he looks like a gentleman, and I like him for that already. Beware of men with manners, you know what I mean? <laughs> That's the green snake in the green grass.